Good morning children. Welcome back to the class. Lesson number 16. Natural resources. Natural resources. Okay children. So, so far we are studying about the natural resources. So, in that we studied the types of natural resources. So, yesterday I explained you the two types of natural resources. The first one, renewable resources. So, now let us continue the same thing, the renewable resources. So, children, as I explained you, of course, as you can see here, sun, air, water, forest, soil. So, these are all the uh, renewable resources, mean to say, inexhaustible resources. So, sun, air, water, forest, soil have no end have no end so this is a table here uh, sun which produce the solar energy and the air is a windmills water hydroelectricity forest green gold and soil is uh, food so this is a table about the renewable resources so Renewable resources are sun, air, water, forest and soil. So under sun we have a solar energy. So now we will study one by one. <coughs> one by <coughs> one. So next we have solar energy solar energy children solar energy means i think you must be knowing it already so now we have solar boiling water solar cookers and solar lights there are domestic uh, appliances uh, which are making use in the houses at the emergency time so, in certain places, we are making use of this only for emergency sake. But there are places, some uh, backward areas, uh, backward places, where uh, the solar energy has become life. Solar energy has become life. So, uh, if you want to see uh, about it, so already as far I know, and even last time, I think one of the class, I had explained to you, solar system is much introduced in uh, like called Rajasthan, the interior places of Rajasthan, Gujarat and even Madhya Pradesh and Odisha, the other places. Of course, the these are so called domestic appliances. So, we are making use of the solar energy. So, children, you know how powerful is the sun. So, even through the radiation of sun, the water can be heated. Water can be heated so that we can, where we can have bath. So, sun is a, a source of, big source, big source of energy. Energy. So, sun is a big source of energy. It is inexhaustible. Solar energy is being used extensively in vehicles. Solar energy is also used in domestic appliances such as solar geysers, solar cookers and solar lights. So, children... Of course, uh, okay, uh, you people are in cities. There are people, those are still living in uh, villages and even some farmhouses and some are in the field and the other things and all. So, now the solar lights are become very useful for a man. Very useful for man. So, if we just go around, around the places, especially in the village areas and if you see the many people have been adopted to this type of system that is a solar system 
so they have in their in their houses even though if there are no electrical pole but they have lights in their house so how it is possible that is because of a solar energy aapko the solar energy has been so prompt and so powerful the radiation of sun so during the day what happens the <coughs> the plate it has got a plate with a plate which will be heated by the radiation of the sun the rays of the sun so old day old day uh, due to the radiation of the sun or it can be the rays of the sun that this plate so called solar plate can be heated very hot heated so this heating of the uh, solar it uh, uh produces the electricity produces the light so in the night during the day i have seen people keep it for charging and in the night you get very fantastic bright light through the solars so even in our houses also uh, we are making use of the solar lights as soon as in the electricity goes the power goes off the automatically the solar lights uh, uh light they light up so that means you see the uh, power of the solar energy so children somewhere even for the cooking purposes we are using the solar energy even for the vehicles for the electricity in order to produce the electricity we are using in the vehicles so in the houses we are using for many uh, domestic appliances we are using so therefore therefore the solar energy has become one of the popular necessary and uh, should and must wanted or needed in uh, remote areas or backward areas because where people are not able to afford so much of taking the electricity or people those are living very remote areas where there are no electrical poles so people it is very helpful for them to have such a system so chilla solar energy sun is a big source of energy it is inexhaustible solar sun has no ex- uh, no end at all <coughs> solar energy is being used extensively in the vehicles solar energy is also used in domestic appliances such as solar geysers solar cookers and solar lights so next we have solar energy can be trapped through solar panels so in the test we can see uh, there is a solar panel you can see with the black very long in square and above that you can see the picture of the sun how the uh rays of the sun are falling on that uh, panels so this is uh, trapped trapped in the sense of how we trap someone in our uh, uh planning the other things so same way the solar energy can be trapped through the solar panels so in the test book it is very clearly can be seen so you see the panels through that we can trap the solar energy so the cost of tapping solar energy is still high but very soon it will be made affordable so of course it is very high very costly and high it is but still it is very affordable means you can can purchase it can able to buy it can able to have it in a houses so it is therefore rightly call the resources of the future so in future <coughs> in future we can uh, complete i think we can depend on this uh, uh, solar energy i hope so because uh, now through the solar energy we are using lot of things lot of things we are making use of. even if you go to the shops and all so people are making use of this uh, solar lights only in the house you take or in the shops you take even in a big big malls and uh, do you think uh, such electric electrical bill 
is uh, day by day is rising so if the lights have been taking like that uh, in the malls and all whole day and night lights will burn so in that case the people go for the solar lights where haven't to be paid much so no not at all be paid only when they purchase the solar panels we need to pay other than that so it is a uh, uh, free producing the electricity through the solar energy so children so once upon a time or even in even in a future i think so now everyone will go for the uh, resources of uh, the solar energy in future i can say because it is a free gift of nature so you can it uh, can be affordable so therefore uh, the solar energy has got uh, such a uh, huge demand and it is one of the very good useful for the domestic appliances okay children <coughs> let's go through the lesson <coughs> read lesson for yourselves so that you might understand properly okay children okay bye